mwamo mwamo mwazong mwada kwabu and the music they're playing is a royal kind of music that is played only in special ceremonies like this from now on the rest of the community would consider him as Nana and will so be called and respected as you also you can see the kente cloth is not just a cloth it's more than a cloth and every cloth that is being worn here as a name, as a meaning, and uh, has to be worn at the appropriate time. Now he has to have a special handshake with the king's representative to indicate that flesh has touched flesh blood has touched blood and uh, that symbolizes <inaudible> the reunion <inaudible> of the spirit and the flesh which is very important in the Asante values system. The representative of the king of the Asante people here has given special thanks to all of you for coming whether you're American, Ghanaian, African, African-American, wherever you came from this stand special greetings, a special thanks to you for being part of this important celebration. And he's going to take the message to the king of the Sandy people that he has witnessed and supervised over this important ceremony. The drummer is now talking, the drum language, singing the praises of the chief and the elders on the drum. On the drum, master drummer is Mr. Ansa Brew, who is also a Ghanaian. Now, the function is coming to close. The chief and the queen mother are dancing. They're gonna meet each other and hug each other symbolizing the unity and the union. There they go. They have finally had each other met together. Every movement of the hand is an indication that he is very grateful to you all for coming and uh, that he's going to do his work, his job as the chief of the Asante Manku in Washington here. And everybody is happy, joyful, spiritually uplifted, ready to work with this chief and the queen mother to bring success, to bring improvement and development among their people.